what did happen to the last ten? I ran away with my life, fast forward, never turn back again. It's kind of funny that the more we pass time, the more we need to set the rewind. And 19 was the year I had to leave you, but now I'm seeing all the signs. Is this really happening? I can't believe it's true. I'm just as surprised as you. Is this really happening? I can't be too sure. But one day I'll be yours again. Something from nothing I sit here looking for an answer Maybe the biggest question was in the last chapter You gave me the soul I had to do From the village They were both so grateful for my help that they each kissed one of my hands We also caught her talking to Prince Daniel I'm so sorry, he started talking to me and... Silence, you were forbidden to see him We'll discuss your punishment later Are you sure you want to go through with this? Yes, and don't come back until the job is done so you're allowing me to go out in the village today? Are you sure you're not still mad? All is forgiven. Thank you. My best god will be with you for protection. Come along, princess. <laughs> oh, sweetheart, don't cry. I picked this flower earlier. Would you like to have it? Yes, please. You don't know how much that means to her. Allow me to repay you for your kindness. Oh, you really don't. Mwah. Everyone, let's all kiss the princess's hand so we can raise her score. Yeah! Good job, everyone. She's almost about to beat the Evil Queen's score. Today was an eventful day, huh? I just hope that Stepmother doesn't mind that my kiss score is almost as high as hers. After tonight, I don't think she'll mind. Let's get you back home. We're almost there. No, stop. You keep saying that, and I don't remember the way to the castle being this way. <sighs> well, Princess, that's because it's not. No. I'm sorry, Princess. Why are you doing this? The Queen believes you are a threat to her kiss score. She ordered me to get rid of you. I don't want to kill you, but if I don't, she'll kill me. Close your eyes. Oh. Stay back. Daniel. Run. Run and don't come back. Hello? Is anyone home? Hello? Please help me. The Queen, she was trying to kill- Whoa, whoa, sweetheart. It's all right. Come on, let's get you inside. Thank you for letting me stay here. Your dog is so sweet. Of course, it's our pleasure, dear. Good night, sweetheart. Come here. Princess, I'm taking the dog out for a walk. Don't answer the door to anyone. Okay. Why you, Sydney? Get away from him. You don't make the rules anymore, stepmother. I do. And you're hereby dethroned. <laughs> you wouldn't dare hurt me with that sword. Try me and see what happens. <gasps> Guards? No! You fools, get off of me! Finally, we have a good queen. Yes, Ken, and you were a real star, be a ten. 
Mommy, what's that? It's like charades, honey. You just have to act out your word very quickly, and I have to guess. Okay, you ready? Oh, a, a dog. <sighs> Understand how to play? Yeah. I got a word now. What am I riding? Um, a bike? No, not a bike. You use your feet. A motorcycle? No, honey, please hurry or something bad is going to happen to mommy. I don't know. I don't I know. bought this for you for your birthday. Um, a scooter? Yes. Oh, I'm safe. I don't like this game. A camera? No, and the time's up. No, I'm so sorry. I couldn't guess it in time. Sissy, I got a word. Rar. Okay, um, a lion? No. <laughs> a tiger? A bear? No, no, not that. Come on, Susie, you only have ten seconds left. Rar. A cheetah? A leopard? A... Just tell me what it is. Whisper the word. Okay, uh, it's a panther. A panther! Yay, you got it right. I'm safe. Yeah. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> Officer? Hello, ma'am. We're looking for a girl named Susie. Learn a fact about every item you touch, or forget a memory every time you touch an item. I think I'm gonna go with this one. Got my birthday gift. Let me see. My parents got it for me. It's designer. Parents bought this at Walmart. What? Why are you making that face? <laughs> Nothing. It's so cute. Thanks. It was probably so expensive. Hey, Mom, is it cool if I go to the beach with Ryan just for a few minutes? Darling, you know how I feel about you going in the water. Mom, your irrational fear of me being eaten by a shark is not going to come true. I promise you. It's actually very rational, dear, so the answer is no, it's not safe. Mom, come on, please, just this one time. Took you from your mom. Why are you looking at me like that? No, it's just you're right. Forget I even asked. Okay. This system has to be broken. Hey, psst, over here. Ryan, what are you doing at my window? Just trying to sneak you out from your strict mom so you can go to the beach. Did you dye your hair? What? Part of your transformation. You good? Hello? Yeah, let's sneak out of here and go to the beach. I need some fresh air. Come on, you gotta actually come in the water. Ryan! Place where your mom was captured. Melanie? Is something wrong? Come on, you gotta actually come in the water. Ryan! Place where mom was captured. Melanie? Is something wrong? Okay, this is gonna sound crazy. You think you're turning into a mermaid? And your mom took you from your real mom? But think about it, my mom never tells me that she loves me, and she never wants me to go in the ocean. She's paranoid of sharks. Do you really believe that story? I mean, it sounds more realistic than you turning into a fish. <laughs> you know what, you're right. The system is probably just broken, and my hair is probably just having a reaction to my new shampoo. Yeah, do you want me to walk you home? No offense, but she doesn't really like you, so... It's cool. Just be careful. Thanks, I will. Oh, darling, can you get me my phone? Of course. Do you smell that? It smells like... salt water. I don't smell anything. Has secret videos of you? It's just a glitch. She wouldn't have something like that on her phone. Wait, what's this? It's been one week since the subject has given birth. So far, her child has shown no signs of being a mermaid. What are you watching? What's this? It's been one week since the subject has given birth. So far, her child has shown no signs of being a mermaid. What are you watching? Were you watching a video? I was just reading one of your texts. Um, you got a text from my doctor saying um, this is urgent. She needs to come in for her next appointment. Give me that. I'm really sorry. I, I should probably just go to bed. It's getting late. Not so fast. It's only 6 p.m. Is your hair turning blue? We're going to see your doctor right now. Have you noticed any changes happening to you lately? Be honest, honey. No. Interesting. Did you notice your hair is changing color? Yeah, I think my hair is just having a reaction to my new shampoo. Mm-hmm. Okay, let's take your temperature open. Using this to drug you. Actually, I was wondering, could I use the restroom really quick? <sighs> of course. Just don't be too long, okay, honey? I have to get out of here. Your real mom is behind door. I have to get out of here. Real mom is behind door. Mom? You want me to drain the tank? If I do that, won't you die? Oh, um, here. Thank you. How did you do that? How did you just transform into a human? I can't believe you found me. I can transform into a human because I'm part human, and so are you. They took you away from me. 
They told me I would never see you again. Dying. You're dying. I need to get back to the ocean. They've had me here for so long. Your father, he tried to stop them. My real father, where is he? Your father is dead. He died trying to save you. How could you? <laughs> we had to do whatever it took. Research is what we live for. Now get back in the tank. You stay away from her. <laughs> you can't stop us. You're turning into a mermaid too. Time to give up. Not quite. Freeze, both of you. Ryan. Hey, let go of me. You should be arresting the mermaid freaks, not us. Melanie, are you okay? Both of us need to get to the ocean. Okay, come on. My dad and I will help you guys. Has crush on you. We can take my police car. Come on. Thank you. Uh, we made it to the ocean. I don't feel so... Melanie? Melanie! Whoa. You look amazing. You can't tell. Don't worry. Your secret's safe with us. Thank you. We must go. But... I'll come visit you again. I promise. Okay. Ryan, wait. Just in case I don't see you for a little while. What are you... Don't take too long to come back, okay? Anything I touch turns to money, or any doll I touch comes to life. I'm too little to have money, and I don't have any friends in foster care, so I pick this one. I pick this Barbie to come to life. Whoa. Hi, I'm Come Alive Barbie. Are you gonna be my friend? Of course, I can be anything you want me to be. You can brush my hair and take me anywhere. Cool. You can also customize me using this remote. I want to give you brown eyes like me. Oh, Claire, who are you talking to? Uh-oh, who's that? That's another foster girl that lives here and she's really mean to dolls. We have to hide you, come on. Claire, who are you talking to? Nobody. Hi, I'm Come Alive Barbie. What the? Barbie, I told you to hide. Sorry, Claire. I just love making new friends. Does this control her? Hey, give that back. Ugh, just let me see it. Stop! You're gonna break her. Ugh, you're so annoying. This is why no one wants to adopt you. I don't want your dumb remote anyways. You killed her. <laughs> Have fun with your dead Barbie. Barbie, please wake up. Hola. Soy Barbie. ¿Cómo estás? Uh-oh, I think she reset you onto Spanish mode. Eres mi mejor amiga. Barbie, I can't understand you. What am I gonna do? Barbie, I can use my powers to bring Ken to life to help us. I hope you know how to bring Barbie off of Spanish mode. Hey, Barbie. Hola, Ken. Why is she speaking Spanish? That's why I brought you here, Ken. I don't know how to make her speak English. Can I see her remote? Sure. That should do it. Hey, Barbie. Hi, Ken. Want to go for a drive? Sure, Ken. Activate the Barbie car. We cannot tell anyone that you're dolls. What do we say if they ask us? Tell them that, that you're my parents. Okay. Shh, we have to be really quiet so we can sneak out of here. Thanks for buying me this stuff, Barbie. Claire, you deserve it. Hey, you. You never paid me back my money. Claire. Claire. How dare you? Who are you guys? We are her parents. She got adopted. That's right, and one of her mother's many jobs is being a police officer. So if you don't leave right now, we're going to have you arrested. No, no, sorry, forget about the money. Bye! Claire! Are you okay? My arm got a little cut. Press the top button on the remote. Okay. Dr. Barbie is here to help. You're so strong, Claire. You should be feeling much better now. Barbie, Ken, you said that you can be anything, right? Yeah. That's right. Well, I want you to be my real mommy and daddy. You want us to adopt you? Yeah. Can you do that? Barbie, Ken, you said that you can be anything, right? Yeah. That's right. Well, I want you to be my real mommy and daddy. You want us to adopt you? Yeah. Can you do that? Claire, we... I understand if you don't want to because I know I'm not that great. What? Why would you think that? Because I'm not as smart or as cute as the other kids. I think that's why nobody wants to adopt me. Oh, Claire. Don't think like that. You're so smart. And you're super cute. Do you really think so? Claire, you can do anything you put your mind to. And anyone who tells you otherwise doesn't know what they're talking about. We would be honored to be your parents because you're such a good girl. Right, Ken? That's right, Barbie. Really? Yeah. Being a dad sounds fun. Guys, I forgot I had this in my...
member of our organization. This is number 98. It's time for you to receive your mark. My mark? Mm-hmm. Every girl here has one. Scanning complete category. Red. What does that mean? You are one of the special ones. Now hold out your wrist. That is the mark of the assassin, my dear. Now go get ready for training. Some assassin you are can't even take a punch. Looks like you knocked her unconscious. Great job, 98. Hey, what you did back there with 23? I kind of went too hard on her, didn't I? Actually, I thought that was pretty cool. I'm 52, by the way. I'm 98. Good work. This is your final test. You are to eliminate the subject. Bring it out. Your mark doesn't allow for any weaknesses. What are you waiting for, 98? Take the shot. Aye. What is our motto? No attachments, no weaknesses. That's right, and you've worked very hard to get here, so don't blow it. I can't. <laughs> Idiot! Show me your mark. That's the assassin's mark, not a coward. Now pick up your weapon. Prove to me you have what it takes. What are you- Hey, it's okay. I got you. Oh, you chose that dog over me! 98? W what's going on? I'm escaping this place. Come with me. Is that a dog? Yeah, I'm saving it. Come on, we have to go now. I can't. I have the mark of a technophile. I'm not as agile as you. I can't make it out of here. 52, that's not true. We can make it if we... Attention all girls. 98 has gone rogue. She must be stopped by any means necessary. I think I know a way you can escape. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. I got the back gate open, but you gotta run fast. Okay. It's 98. Get her! Uh. Hey, we made it. Oh, thank goodness. I'm really gonna miss... Uh. Excuse me. Do you need some help? Yes. I sort of ran away from home. Oh, darling. Uh, do you need somewhere to stay? Okay, well, it's not safe here for you and your little pup. Why don't you come with me? Come on, honey. Let me help you out. So, darling, what happened to you? Um, I'd rather not talk about it, if that's okay. Um, uh, I see. Wait, what's that on your wrist? Oh, it's just, uh, something I drew on myself. <laughs> darling, I prepared a bed for you and your little pup. You better get some rest. Thank you so much. I'm happy to help. Morning. Your little pup was looking for you. Do you want me to call your parents? No, I, I don't have parents. Oh, are you a foster child? I was. That mark on your wrist, does that have anything to do with where you came from? Darling, I want you to know that you can trust me. But if I'm going to let you stay in my house, I need to know more about you. Okay. And the next thing I know, I wake up and I can't remember my name. Instead, they gave me a number. 98. Oh, darling, that's awful. Listen, you can stay here as long as you like. Thank you. It's my pleasure. No child should have to go through that. Now, let me get you cleaned up, all right? Because that sure is a pretty bad cut you got there. All right, I'm going to go get you two some food. I'll be back. Hey, girl, calm down. 98. 52. Oh, my gosh, I can't believe I found you. I escaped. Hey, Curl, relax. She's a friend. Listen, a nice lady let me stay here, and I'm pretty sure she'll let you stay here, too. Really? Where is she? Oh, she's at the store. Good. I mean, good for you, 98. I'm glad you found help. Wait, what was that? What? That sound. Do it now. I don't know what you're talking about. Are you on comms with the director? Uh, you weren't supposed to <clears throat> hear that. <clears throat> stay back. <clears throat> Shut up. Go get help. <clears throat> No, hey, get back here. Oh, sorry, 98. Yes, ma'am, I'm, I'm bringing her now. She's more skilled than I thought. We just need to make her more compliant. You must comply. No, no. You will comply. You must. Okay, I think that's enough time. Now, tell me a mission, 98. To eliminate the dog. And what else? And get rid of the woman who took me in. I'm glad you understand, because there's no room for air. So you're going to do exactly what I say. Darling, there you are. I was so worried. Your pup came and found me. Where were you? I went for a walk. A walk? Really? Yes, a walk. Now, no more questions. Please, darling, don't do this. I think that organization did something to you. They messed with your head. Take the shot, 98. 
Look, look at your pup. Uh, uh, 98, do you hear me? Do it. I can't. I, I know them. You idiot. Uh, oh, look at my big girl. Be careful now, Rose. I remember my name. It's... I had a feeling this might happen. Look at me, 98. You must comply. Pick up the gun. Good. Now, take the shot. Darling, don't listen to her. A million dollars or a hair clip? Come on. Whoops, sorry. Phoebe, do you know what you just made me do? I didn't mean to. Mom says it's your turn to take out the trash. No, she didn't. She said it was your turn five minutes ago. Hey, wait. How do you know that? You weren't there. Uh, I don't know. I just, I just do, okay? I don't think I can make it to your party. What? Why not? You always come to my parties. Sorry, but my mom's not letting me go. You sure that's the real reason why? Uh, yeah. Anyways, I gotta get to calculus. Hey, I think this clip is telling you the truth about people. You ready for a date, babe? Yeah, I'm so sorry. I don't think I'm gonna make it. What? Why? Something came up at work and it's urgent. Babe, you work at a computer factory. How urgent can it be? I'll explain later. Don't worry. I gotta go. So all this time he's been lying to me about his job. I have to follow him. Did you get the codes? Yes, sir. I have them on my phone. And you're sure you weren't followed? Not that I know of. Excellent. Because I have another job for you. Hey, who the hell are you? Um, I'm... That's it. Get over uh, here. Uh, hey, boss. Look who I found spying on us. No, I, I wasn't spying on you guys, I swear. Who do you work for? Who sends you? No, nobody. Hey, stop. She's with me. You know this girl? Yeah, I do. She's... She's my girlfriend. Jack, I am so sorry that I followed you. I don't have any wires on me or- Quiet. I told you. No attachments, Jack. She was just a cover, sir. Good. Then you shouldn't have any problem with me getting rid of her. Sorry, sweetheart. But I can't have you running away and crying to the cops. You're not gonna shoot me. Why is that? Because you can't. You have no idea what I'm capable of. What? It's jammed. Okay, both of you drop your weapons now. Really, Jack? You're gonna turn against me, huh? Sorry, sir. Can't let you kill her. Now slide those weapons over to me. Alright, let's go. You're gonna regret this. So when were you gonna tell me that you're a criminal? How did you know his gun was jammed? No, I asked you first. Answer me. Listen, there's no time to explain. We have to change our appearance. They're gonna come looking for us soon. Take this cash, you're going to run to that store quick and go buy us new clothes. Okay, and what are you going to do? I'm going to stay here and keep an eye out for anyone looking suspicious. Okay, fine. I really like your hair clip. Thank you. Are you here all by yourself? What happened? There was a woman in there who was acting really suspicious. I think they're on to us. We, we need to get out of here now. Okay, get in. Jack, this is in our car. I know. Now let's go. I still can't believe you hotwired someone's car. I had to. My boss knows my license plate. He could have tracked us. I just hope this hair clip still works if I'm not wearing it in my hair. Huh? Look, this is going to sound kind of crazy, but this hair clip is magic. It tells me the truth about people. It's how I knew your boss's gun was jammed, and it's why I followed you to work. You're joking, right? No, and honestly, it's really been coming in handy, so... What's wrong? My boss. He's here. Well, what do we do? He's headed right towards us. Follow me. I think we lost him. Yeah, for now. Jack, I can't keep doing this, okay? We've been on the run all night. I'm tired. I think I know a place where we can crash for the night. Hey, I just want to say I'm sorry for all this. You broke my trust, Jack. I know, and I'm going to do everything I can to gain it back. I promise, I'll fix this. Now get some sleep. We'll talk more about this magic hair clip in the morning. Okay. Jack. Looking for Jack? You really thought you could get away from us? Where is he? He won't be able to save you this time. Get over there. I want to make a deal with you. You come work for me, and in return... I'll let Jack go free. I don't think I can trust you guys. It's not really your choice. 
Unless you want to see your boyfriend dead. You're not going to kill Jack because you're his parents. What? How did you... How does she know that? I don't know. She... She must be a spy. Yeah, I kind of realize that now. Who are you talking to? She's obviously talking to someone on comms. No, I'm not talking to anyone, I swear. I bet her hair clip is a camera. No. No, wait. Give that back. Quiet. There's no camera or microphone, but it is a cute hair clip. No. What the? This thing just spoke to me. What'd it say? It said she's feeling worried. How could the hair clip know that she's nervous? You know, I've heard about things like this. I think this hair clip might be magic. Oh, come on. Don't be ridiculous. No, it all makes sense now. That's how she knew my gun was jammed. And how she knew to avoid me at the store. Make this thing tell us the code to the... It doesn't work like that. Sure it does. You're just holding out on us. You make this clip tell us everything we want to know, or else we're gonna... Hey! That's enough! Did you just... No, don't worry. They were just trained darts. Now let's get you free. I believe this belongs to you. Thanks. So, um, what now? You have to turn my family and I in. What? Jack, I'm not gonna turn you in, I... It's okay. I'm sure your parents have reported you missing by now. It was gonna happen to me eventually, so just make the call. I'm gonna find a way to bail you out, okay? I can't believe I'm using my birthday money to bail your boyfriend out of jail. Hey, you owe me big time, remember? Yeah, yeah. Jack! Brooke, how did you bail me out? My sister gave me her birthday money. Wait, where's your hair clip? Well, that was the deal. I gave her my hair clip, and she gave me her money. You did that for me? Brooke, I can't thank you enough. Well, hey, I don't need to use it with you, because I know you'll always be truthful with me. I promise you, I will. Hey, yo, you see that nerd right there? I bet you 500 bucks you can't get her a date for the prom. 500? All right, bet, bro, you're on. Okay, but if you lose, you owe me 500. Hey, excuse me? Yeah? Please tell me you got two options today. Yeah, I did. But what's it to you? Just tell me what they are, please. I got the option to be smart or be beautiful, but I haven't picked one yet because I can't decide. Pick to be beautiful. Excuse me? Uh, I just mean you're already the smartest girl here, so I would just pick to be beautiful if I were you. <laughs> you really think that I should? Oh, yeah. Wow. Well, okay. Nothing's changed. Oh, man. Maybe the system's broken. I think it's still loading. But prom's in two days. Yeah, so? Listen, how would you like to go on a little shopping spree with me? You barely even talk to me. Why would you want to take me- I want to be your friend. Come on. Well, my mom does say I need to make more friends. So? Fine. But just so you know, my mom has installed a chip in the back of my head so she can track me wherever I go. Okay. I'm just saying in case you're trying to kidnap me. Uh-huh. Can I see those glasses? Sure, but they're a little busted. And now they're completely busted. Why would you- Chill, chill out. I'll get you something better. But I can't see without my glasses. And that's the bell. Follow me. What does your beauty option say? I would tell you what it said, but I can't see because you broke my glasses. I told you I'm gonna buy you contacts, but first we gotta fix that unibrow. I'm gonna pluck a few hairs, okay? No way. Come on, I'm just trying to help you out. I'm gonna make your eyebrows look snatched. It won't hurt too bad, right? Nah, we're just plucking a few little hairs. Ow! Okay, that was a big one. Please tell me you're done. I'm done. And it's looking good. Yikes, I can do eyebrows, but not hair. Time for a professional makeover. A makeover? Yeah, you know, like in those teen movies. It'll be fun. I don't know. Don't be a negative Nancy. Come on, we're going to the mall. I won't even be able to see where I'm going. Just hold my hand and I'll guide you around. Hey, it's okay. You can trust me. I'll buy you contacts once we get there. Let's go. Those should be your prescription. Can you see? Yeah. Perfect. Now try these on. Remind me again why we're doing this. Uh, I'm just trying to be a good friend to you. That's all. Okay, that top is the one. Now we just gotta get you some hair and makeup to go with it. I will be your hair and makeup artist. Come with me. Are you ready to see her? Yes, ma'am. Let him see, honey. Holy shit. She looks, uh, beautiful. Now you have my number. Call me for prom. Bye. How do you feel? I feel... 
different. Hopefully it's a good different, because next we got to get you a date to the prom. Why don't I just go with you? Oh, actually, I was planning on asking this other girl, so, uh... Right, of course. But hey, listen, you deserve better than me. You know how to flirt, right? Well, sure I do. Okay, let's go over a few things then. First off, guys kind of like it when girls, you know, play with their hair. Like this? Oh boy, we got some work to do. Okay, let's try a subtle lip bite. Uh, no, don't do that. Try again. You know what, never mind. Okay, pretend to ask me to prom. Go to prom with me. Ow. Okay, let's try asking and not grabbing so hard. Sorry. Hey, will you go to the prom with me? All right, that was perfect. If you stare at a guy like that with your eyes, he'll be <clears throat> mesmerized, yeah. I should probably get back home. Yeah, for sure. Hey, Jake, guess what? I got someone to go to the prom with me. Really? Who? Him. Sup, Jake? Bet you didn't see this coming. Here's your 500 bucks, Jake. I guess you won the bet. I didn't think I'd be the one taking her on a date, but damn, she's hot now. I mean, she was already kind of cute. And eh, well, I just want a hot date. After prom, I'm gonna dump her. What? She'll get over it. I'll talk to you later. Hey, can we talk for a second? What's up? I can't let you go to the prom with him. You can't go to prom with him. What? Why not? Don't mess with my prom date, Jake. I'm not gonna let you use her. Me? You're the one that's been using her. What is he talking about? I was just trying to help you look nice because... Because I made him a bet. A bet? Yep, that you couldn't get a date to the prom. Listen, I know that sounds bad, but... I thought you said you were helping me so you could be my friend. I... You were just using me for money. No. I'm sorry, I should Get away from me. And to think I actually liked... Layla. Never talk to me again. Forget them and forget the system. I was beautiful before this makeover and I'm beautiful now. Maybe this option wasn't supposed to make me beautiful. It was supposed to show me that I already am. But I think for prom, maybe I won't wear the glasses. And you know what? I don't need any guy to go with. I'm going on my own. Hey, Layla. What you doing? Walking to my Uber. Uber? I told you I'm taking you to prom. And I told you I'm not going with you to prom anymore. I'm going alone. That's not gonna happen. <laughs> Let go! Get in my car. I told you I'm taking you to prom. And I told you I'm not going with you to prom anymore. I'm going alone. That's not gonna happen. <laughs> Let go! Get in my car. No! Hey, Ricky. Let her go. Jake. Get out of here, Jake. I'm not going anywhere, Ricky. Get away from me. I said let her go. <laughs> oh. All right, that's it. Come here. Ricky, I don't want to... Oh, stop it. Leave him alone. Ricky, come on. Let's not... Oh. Shut up. Hey, Ricky. Oh. Stay down. Oh. Oh. Hey, are you all right? I'm fine, but you're bleeding. Yeah, he got me pretty good. Hang on. Oh. I'm going to call the police, okay? Okay. Hey, how you doing? Uh, you know, I've been better, but the doctor said I'm clear to go home, so that's good. Thank you so much for saving me. You kind of saved me with that kick. <laughs> <laughs> Layla, you need to know, that bet was stupid. You were already beautiful. Thanks, Jake. I kind of already found that out for myself. Because you're smart. Well, lucky for us, there's one hour of prom left. I'll let you go hang out with the girl you said you were going to ask. Layla, wait. I don't want to go to prom with anyone but you. I thought you just wanted to be friends. No, Layla, I don't. I mean, if it's okay with you, I'd like to be more than that. I would like that. So should we head to prom? <laughs> hey, guys. Hey, man. Wait, are you crying? What? No, I'm not. Come on, Brianna, we're your best friend. You can tell us anything. Can you guys just come over to my house? So what's wrong? It's Derek. He... He broke up with me over text today. Wait, Derek? As in the school player, Derek? School player? What do you mean? He plays every girl in school. He'll act like he likes you, he'll use you, and then he'll break your heart. Seriously? Why would he do that? No one knows, but what I know is that it's time someone taught him a lesson. We could do it. No, I don't know about that. Yeah, Nicole, I don't know. It might not work. Trust me, ladies. It will work, and I have the perfect plan. Step one is to give you a makeover so that you look absolutely irresistible. Step two, get his attention. Step three, get him to go out with you. Bree, you, uh, <clears throat> you look different. Do you like my new look? You know, Bri I've been thinking. I made a huge mistake breaking up with you. Um, how about, how about I take you on a date or, or something so that we can talk? 
Uh, I don't know. Oh, come on. Have you ever made a mistake? Okay, fine. But you are paying for the date. Okay. Okay, girls, take these so you can listen to our conversation. Okay. It's time to get revenge on the school player. Thanks again for giving me a second chance. Of course, but, um, can I ask you something? Sure, a anything. When you and I were dating, you know, before you broke up with me, <laughs> did you ever, did you ever cheat? Um. Hey, I promise I won't be mad, okay? I cheated more. I wouldn't even consider it cheating, to be honest. It was nothing. <laughs> Are you serious? Girls come up to me all the time, asking, do you want to hang out? Like, what am I supposed to say? Like... So have you, like, cheated on other girls, too? Cheating... cheating's a strong word. Derek, it's a yes or no answer, come on. <laughs> Why do I feel like I'm being interrogated right now? Okay, yeah, that was in the past. I want to focus on us. I want to focus on you. <sighs> oh gosh, would you look at that. My mom needs me to come home. Oh, and we were having so much fun. Don't worry, I'll see you tomorrow at school, okay? It's time to get revenge on the school player. Marie, come here. Why is everyone staring at us? Mm, no one's staring at me, Derek. They're staring at you. What are you talking about? Oh, how cute. He still doesn't know. Don't know what? Exactly. Got your little confession on the video. Derek, remember how you used to tease me for being a klutz? Well, clumsy old me. I was recording you. I didn't realize. And then I accidentally leaked the video to the entire school. You what? Yeah. Maybe next time you'll think twice before playing every girl in school. I'm a go-getter. If I see what I like, I'm gonna go after it. <laughs> Sorry, Derek, but I had to. I don't want any girl to go through what I went through. Because no one deserves to get their emotions played with. Have a nice day. Now, if you'll excuse us, we have some celebrating to do. <laughs> so, how many words you get for the year? Only three again. Aw, oh, might as well use them up. Come on. I love you. And I love you more. Hi, what can I get you today? She doesn't have any words, miss, but I'll order for her. She's just gonna have a salad, but I'm gonna get a cheeseburger, double fries. Babe, you're looking kind of pale today. You wanna get your makeup done? Yeah, you do. Come on, let's go. I love this color on you. Me too. Hey, babe, show her the bruise. Any chance you can cover that? She's so clumsy. Oh, yeah, totally. We can take care of that. Sir, would you wanna buy the concealer I use on her? Actually, yeah, that'd be great. I'll go pay for this. You stay here. I love this. He can't hear us anymore. Here, take some. You can trust me. Is something wrong? He can't hear you right now. He's not my boyfriend. He's not, is he? I knew it. Okay, listen, I'm going to get help for you. But I'm gonna need you to give me some more information. He's coming. Okay, got the concealer. Time to go. Sir, wait! He's not my boyfriend. He's not, is he? I knew it. Okay, listen, I'm going to get help for you. But I'm gonna need you to give me some more information. He's coming. Okay, got the concealer. Time to go. Sir, wait. Why is the makeup lady chasing after us? Sir! Let's get out of here. Well, that was weird. Did she at least cover up your bruise? Good. Good. Go change your hair to a different style. I'm gonna go make dinner. You look much better now, babe. Breaking news as of today. What's going on? Let me turn this up. No, don't! Did you just... How the hell did you get words? So now you want to be quiet, huh? Answer me! How did you get them? You don't have any left now, do you? Give me that remote. You better hope this news isn't about you. So this girl comes into my makeup store with a bruise. I gave her some words and it turns out the man she was with... <laughs> you ratted me out? After everything that I've done for you. I have been so good to you. Now that's gonna change. Police, open the door. They finally found me. But they won't find you. Officer, I'm telling you, you've got the wrong guy. I'm the only one who lives here. Yeah, well, I've searched the whole place. I haven't seen anything. Right, the missing girl's obviously not here. It seems so, but you match the description of the kidnapper. There's definitely been a mistake. Down here! I'm down here! What was that? Wait a minute, don't- Oh my god. You found me. Ma'am, stay right there. Mr. Hart, you're under arrest. 
Thank you so much for finding me. He's had me here for two years. He's been controlling your words. What? Yes, ma'am. We found this illegal device on him that steals people's words. That would explain why every year I would only get three words. Go on. Say it. I love you. And he made me say I loved him. Hey, come here. Ugh. You don't deserve to sp- Ugh. Get back here. The only one that doesn't deserve to speak is you. That's right, and she's keeping your words permanently. Now you finally see what it feels like to not have a voice. It doesn't feel good, does it? Prison's gonna be real fun for him. Ugh. You're finally free now. Alright, Mr. Hart, let's go. Any last words before you go off to prison? <sighs> oh wait, you don't have any. <laughs> Excuse me? I saw this flower and I thought of your face. Do you think I have Riz? Honestly, you need to work on it. Why did I just get money? Cuz, sweetheart, every time someone has a crush on you, you get money. We're gonna be witch. Wanna go prom dress shopping? I can't. I'm broke. You have no new crushes? No. Oh my gosh, what did I tell you? You're so pretty, but you don't talk to anyone. That is not true. I talk to Tommy. Tommy is a little creep who likes to stalk you. He doesn't count. You need to talk to other boys. Look, it's not my fault that I have social anxiety. Girl, just let me teach you how to flirt. I can flirt, okay? Here comes a guy. Hi, um, I like your face. Huh? You know that I have a girlfriend, right? Right. <laughs> and you lost more money, didn't you? Yeah. You're coming with me. Fine. This is perfect for prom. I'm telling you I'll buy it for you. And I'm telling you I can't. It's way too short. My parents would kill me. What's going on? What's up with your crushes? I don't know, it just- Hey! What the freak, Tommy? What are you doing in the girls' dressing room? Listen, I posted something that's gonna make you rich. Tommy, what did you post? It's nothing bad, it's just- You tell me what you posted, right? Oh my gosh, you need to see this. Don't get mad. You need to see this. Don't get mad. You recorded me without me knowing? Look, I was just trying to get you some more money. Do you know what's gonna happen when my parents see this video? Are they gonna get mad you're wearing that dress? Come on, you're 18. And that video's viral, so you're gonna be rich. Tommy? Yeah? Delete it. Uh, I kinda got logged out of my TikTok account. You what? <laughs> Her video is getting so many views. You little creep, Tommy. Ow! That's for following us. <clears throat> oh, jeez. And that's for recording me without permission. I was just trying to help. Casey, where are my other clothes? I don't know, they were right here. Hey, looking for these? Hey! See ya! How much money you got now? Two thousand? Wow, I guess your video's really going viral. Girl, calm down. Well, you know, I don't like attention like this. Can you please just buy me this dress and I just want to go home. I actually have to go. What? You'll be fine. You're rich now. Casey, please, you can't just leave me like this. Sorry! Casey! Bye! You're going to wear the dress out? It's going to be a hundred and twenty-two dollars. Where are you going? To the bus. And I would appreciate it if you would stop following me. You're cute. Hey, are you okay? No, I'm not okay. Casey left me with no way home and this creepy guy was following me so I couldn't get the bus home and- I deleted the video. You did? Yeah, it's doing more harm than good. Uh, your friend just posted something. What's happening? Uh, your friend Casey just posted something. This rich girl literally gets mad at me for not buying her a dress. Just buy me this dress? I don't have enough money. Casey! She edited this. I just can't believe that she would do this to me. She definitely got jealous of you getting all these crushes. But you know what? Come on. I'll go with you to go confront her. Look, it's the whiny rich girl. Boo! Get out of here! Hey! The video was faked and we're gonna prove it. Come on. Casey. What is wrong with you? I thought that we were friends. Oh, the video? I was just showing people the real you, that's all. It's not real if you edited it. Yeah! Did you not ask me to buy your dress? You offered to pay for me for that dress. That was before you had $2,000, and then you still asked me to buy it. Well, I'm sorry I wasn't thinking clearly, because I was in the middle of having a panic attack. Well, boo-hoo for you. Just admit you edited the video. Okay, I edited the video. Does that make you feel happy? No one's gonna find out anyways. We wouldn't be so sure about that. Say hello to my live stream with over a million viewers. You've been streaming this? Yep, and you heard the truth here, guys, so pass it on. Whoa. My crushes are disappearing. <laughs> FYI, a lot of people on the live stream were shipping us together. <laughs> well, you kind of stuck up for me when my best friend didn't, so... Are you giving me a chance? If you promise no more stalking. Deal!
Oh my gosh, I've been dreaming of this my whole life. I mean, uh, I'm cool. I'm cool.